Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. It's your girl Zella and how y'all doing today? Cause I'm doing good. Last week I didn't post a video and that's because I had gotten my wisdom teeth out. And so I'm feeling a bit of the soreness still. It's been seven days, but I'm trying to relax as much as I can. I don't really try and talk that much, but I've been able to talk these past few days and just right now for some reason, it's being a little sore. But I do welcome you, my friends, because today's video is gonna be a bit of a fun one. Today is our Christmas video. We're gonna have a fun little Christmas video, even though I sound very monotone right now, but that's just me personally. I have a bit of a haul for you guys too. Just so you can see the kind of stuff I'm about to decorate my house with. It's not gonna be anything insane, just because there's really not much I can really do in terms of decor. Like, I don't wanna do anything too crazy. And um, I'm poor. So without further ado, let's get started. So I also got some Christmas gifts too that I'm not gonna show because I don't know who watches my videos and I don't know if anybody that I bought Christmas for, Christmas gifts for is gonna watch these videos. Guys, these past couple days, I've been very jittery. Like my brain talks faster than my mouth. So like, if I start making not sense, then you guys know why I'm not making any sense. I got this little throw blanket, it's a Christmas throw blanket. It's very simple colors. It's like one of those pajama pants uh, colors. And it's actually gonna go on my couch. I'm gonna cover my couch with it. Hopefully it covers the whole thing. I got some of these Christmas sticker things. I think I still have some from last year, but I have them packed up and I don't feel like I'm packing a lot of stuff still just to find this little thing. So I just bought a new one. It was only $3 and it comes with like 50 counts. So it'll be really useful for the time being. I bought some Feliz Navidad little tissue box because I needed these. I got two. I opened one and completely forgot about it. I was supposed to bring it to work, but nice. I got these cute yet ugly stockings. I got these uh, LED or yeah, LED uh, lights. So this is gonna be the biggest problem when it comes to decorating my apartment. I have my Christmas tree over there. Now the thing is my apartment is kind of in a weird setup when it comes to outlets. So there's three outlets in my living room, but the side where my Christmas tree's at, there's no working outlet. And I can't have anything that'll produce a fire hazard because it's gonna be right up worthy and I don't want that. But I gotta kind of figure out how I'm gonna make this work so it's not right up worthy and everything will be all hunky dory. So I'm gonna have to figure that out, but we'll, we'll figure that out when the time comes. I got these cute uh, red and gold color uh, Christmas balls. I am so excited. I'm not excited about the glitter because I'm not the biggest fan of glitter but I am excited to put these all around the tree. I'm actually super disappointed because for some reason, and I don't know if it's just me, maybe it's you guys too, I'm not too sure. Comment down below if it is you. I haven't seen a single candy cane this year and I don't know why. Like I, everywhere I go for Christmas stuff, I can't find candy canes. I'm not too sure what's going on. Maybe I'm not looking in the right spots, but we gotta figure something out. Maybe. I can try somewhere else. Like I went to Five Below, I went to Target. I didn't see any single candy cane. Maybe I can try Walmart. We'll have to see what happens if I tried Walmart. We'll just figure it out when we get there. Also, I got this cute star. I'm so excited to have a star. I got these cute Christmas wrapping papers that I'm really, really excited about. I got one that's a little penguin. There's one uh, ice skating and then there's another one that's just happy. Look at him. Happy. And then I got this one that's like a black and white that just says happy holidays. It's really cute and I really like the way it looks. I got this uh, tablecloth for the table and it has these cute little Christmas decor on it and I'm really excited for this as well. I'm not having any kind of Christmas celebrations in my house specifically. Um, me and the boyfriend are probably gonna watch Christmas movies and stuff like that around the season time. And then during Christmas, we're gonna spend time with his family, with my family, and we're just gonna have a really nice little Christmas. Also, I got these, and the thing is that they're kind of slanting a little bit. Unfortunately, you can kind of see it if I like make it stand straight, see? So that sucks, but maybe I can fix it up. All right, that's everything in terms of the Christmas stuff. So let's get to decorating. For the time being, 
I'm really trying to figure out how I'm gonna make this Christmas tree thing work. I think I might have it in my dining room corner instead of my living room corner, but we're just gonna have to kind of see because you know, it's a, it's a dining room. So it's not as spacious as you would think it is, but I rarely ever use the dining room. So we're just gonna have to see what happens, but I'm still gonna decorate the dining room though. So it looks a little more presentable. No longer fall. Uh, let's see how you're supposed to open this thing. Pretty sure you're supposed to just actually maybe not. Maybe you're not supposed to throw it there. There's tape on it. I can scissor it, but there's nothing in doing that. Maybe I can do it in the front. I don't know. There we go. This is how we do. There we go. This is how we do, guys. Honestly, this might be very long for the dining table. Oh, it didn't even be a little short. actually belong to a, a blanket set that's on my bed. So these are really just throw pillows for the bed, but then they, they kind of make the uh, couch here look a little cuter. But we're going to put them away until the next season. Okay, the moment of truth. I'm really hoping this can cover the whole couch, or at least the soft part of the couch, because if it doesn't, I'm going to be very, very hurt. Looks. Okay, it's vibing. I think I have some different couches. Okay, it's looking cute. It's looking Christmas. But for the final touch. And gorgeous. It is literally the next day. It is the next day, 5.30, almost six o'clock. Yep, I am a mess of a human being and this video has to come out tomorrow. So we're gonna see what happens. This is gonna be an interesting time. So now I haven't put the tree up yet, but before I put the tree up, I want to get the balls in order. Basically when it comes to these, the hooks are in the inside of them. If you guys ever use this kind of brand. So unless all balls don't have the hooks inside of them, then you have to hook them anyway. Well, regardless, we're gonna be hooking them. I don't think I'm gonna do all of them. I think I might just do a couple because the corner back isn't even going to be shown and it's not really any use to like cover it up if it's not going to be shown. So we're just going to see what happens. I'm just going to put on a video and start going to town with these 50 count stuff. My eyebrows have been funny. I don't have candy canes, which is the biggest disappointment, but I can just add those on later on. This is going to be fun. They have been completed and my hand is now glittery. I have made the unanimous decision to put my Christmas tree in my dining room. I kind of wanted it to be in the living room because the living room is a lot more spacious, but the way that the plugs are in the living room, it wasn't gonna make any sense to put the Christmas tree in the location I wanted it to be. I had to make that decision to put it in this little corner over here. See this corner? I feel like it'll work. It'll work just fine, maybe. But we're really just gonna have to see what happens when it happens. Okay, so I'm kind of hoping it's not gonna make that big of a difference that one of the pieces is missing. But there is another piece that I'm kind of confused about where it goes to. Um, and I'm not too sure what I did with it, but it'll appear on its own. I 
I'm hoping it doesn't. Yeah, no, it's fallen. to look a little bulkier. I got this brand, the Wonder Shop. I thought they'd be smaller. I'm not gonna hold you, but you know, we'll work with it. It'll be okay. I just need to figure out how I'm gonna wrap it around. I'm pretty sure, I, mean, I, I could do bottom to top. I don't think it's that bad right guys. I don't think so. So definitely give it a try, see what happens. pretty big update, sort of, not really. As you can see, I moved the tree and I got different lights. So let me explain what exactly happened in the time frame while I got to town with this. Basically, this tree was on, was in my dining room. It was in my dining room. And what happened was, was that the wires weren't long enough to go towards the plug. Now you're probably wondering yourself, Alice, why didn't you just move the tree towards the plug? Well, since the tree is missing a piece of the bottom that's supposed to keep it leveled, if I were to move it, it would have been one in front of the windows and two, if it fell, then it would have been whatever. And three, it would have been way too close to this heater that is on. So I had to move it and I also had to get rid of using the uh one of the wires to keep it plugged in because i learned that that wire was most likely not allowed in my apartment so did i have to toss it it is what it is well i'll probably give it to boyfriend i'm probably am going to give it to boyfriend the lights i can explain also so if you saw the clip before the lights were a little bulkier i asked my best friend to come by and we switched lights because she had a lot of these tiny lights and i was like you know what let me take some the only thing is that I have to kind of fix it so it looks a little better. But other than that, we're, we're doing pretty well. Now we're gonna put the little bulbs around the tree. That's gonna be it for today's vlog. Well, this week's vlog. I hope you guys had fun with me because I had fun too. It's definitely looking a little more Christmassy in this corner, um, but it is what it is, right, Pikachu? Oh, that's Pikachu's back. If you guys really like the vlog, give this vlog a like, and if you wanna come along for the ride, just hit subscribe, you know? Oh, I rhymed. I like that, that rhymed. I hope you guys have a Merry Christmas, and I'll see y'all next week. Bye.